Master Iron Fist, Lieutenant Kalik and Sergeant Pyridak reporting. Hmm. Proceed. <sighs> While dutifully patrolling the beach at Brighton Point as ordered, we detected a large raiding party of 40 elves invading our territory. When the time was right, we attacked. Oh, how brave. The enemy fell back before the fury of our attack. We accepted our duty to defend our fair land. We killed at least half a dozen of them before they knew what was happening. The rest ran like pigs from an axe. We gave chase, and I saw with my... <laughs> what is so amusing, Master? Nothing. <laughs> Continue. Of course, as I was saying, we were chasing the goblins, shooting them in the backs because they would not stand and fight honorably. We had slain nearly all of the goblins when we saw the sea monsters approaching. At first we thought they had come to help the goblins, but it soon became clear their arrival had nothing to do with the fight on the beach. We ran for cover in the rocks. Each was carrying a bag around his waist and each was wearing a curious amulet that looked like a small black box. What? Wait a minute. Go back. They were about an inch and a half on the side and made of smooth black metal. We couldn't get a closer look. Hmm. Those boxes sound like something out of legend. What happened next? The sea people began to quarrel when one group turned abruptly and started walking away down the beach. The remaining started walking the other way. In the morning, we found that one of them had shed its skin on the beach. Their tracks had washed away in the tide, so we decided to return to base and report. Thank you for your report, Lieutenant Kalik. I am pleased to hear something interesting for once. You are promoted to captain. Assemble a search party at once and find those sea people. If you succeed, you can keep the promotion. As well as your life. Oh, and Kalik, one more thing. Good luck.